Here we have another uh, Last Supper overlay. Uh, this time we take a look at a very famous frame from Les Caves in France. The oldest paintings in the world and I uh, noticed with this cow eyes that uh, falls the same proportion as Jesus. And then a curious uh, word or you know some kind of numbering or lettering here but when we go and line up the bull with Jesus we can see that the cow has the same angle of eyes just in a reflexatory uh, you know mirrored angle Hmm. And it kind of makes it look like Jesus is, you know, looking up at you now. Another curious thing I've discovered is if I use the same Les Cave painting. We flip it, flip it vertical, and mirror it. This seems more like a actual directionality that Jesus uh, is looking. Overlay it again. Upside down ball, we get kind of a disturbing imagery. And, um, yeah, so When we flip the bowl upside down, we essentially get a, uh, I, I would assume, you know, after different images that I've seen of depictions of skinwalkers, this seems to be it. And some, somehow this is in the, uh, the cave, you know, the oldest painting in the world, but it's actually you know, perhaps just a natural mere reflection of what happens when, you know, you, you lose the bullseye. I think, I don't know, there's some spiritual uh, crossover there with this intersecting line. Um, your posture, perhaps your mentality when diving into mirror realities, perhaps the implication that fear or suffering or meditation on suffering will attract the skinwalker. Hmm. But that's not all the animal forms that I could have found. Let's go on to the next one.